Countless books, magazines, and other forms of media often discuss the computer revolution, a term used to refer to the rise of usage of computers and advanced communication technology in the way that it heavily impacts all aspects of social life. This change is not inherently positive, and positive social change needs to be advocated, articulated, and fought for properly. The people who fight for these changes are known as computer revolutionaries. However, there is misinformation surrounding the computer revolution. Lots of media covering the topics is flawed due to the over-exaggeration as they try to appeal to popular audiences. The existence of these myths are due to people only wanting to know the upsides of technology. The three most prominent concerns regarding recent issues relating to newer media are panopticism, which refers to a type of internal surveillance, the alteration of patterns of human sociability, and the mobility and unlocatability of power known as rhizomatic. The article Myth Information by Langdon Winner was published in 1986, a time in which the owning of a personal computer was becoming more and more widespread. Computers were being integrated into everything, along with businesses and homes. These computers revolutionized how we operated from day to day. Also, at this time there was a growing distrust in the government, and people wanted access to more and all information, a plea for greater transparency between the government and its people. It wasn't helped by the fact that the Cold War was still going on at the time. Furthermore, there was this hope that technology would simply fix everything. And this idea was the purpose of Langdon Winner's article, because he strongly disagreed with this viewpoint. Langdon Winner was made part of the New Media Reader because of his discussion of technology and the myth that more technology equaled a better society. In other words, the article discusses the interplay of technology on politics, society, and businesses, and how the idea that making this technology so widespread and available to all was more of a detriment to society than a benefit. The article Myth Information by Langdon Winner is primarily presenting the idea of mass misinformation and idealism about the development of computers. Despite being written in 1984, the general sentiment about computers' integration to common life and overall development is still true. The author's opinion on a computer revolution which was mentioned multiple times throughout the article remains strikingly accurate to this day, despite a belief that computers would equalize power dynamics between rich, advantaged, poor, and disadvantaged groups, the author was sharp to doubt this idealization of technological progress. Many of the points made against these ideologies are relevant to how society and computers progressed since 1984. Points such as, the public's compliance with computer banks' invasion of privacy, an increase in individuality rather than community, and that making information easy to access will not result in people knowing how to translate it into something useful, are all still present today. The author pointed out that simply arming the people with powerful computers would not allow them to go head-to-head -head with major organizations, and this stands true as big organizations still hold power, knowledge, and experience, even in a virtual domain.